Welcome to this Arnold Culliford knitwear tutorial on working the intarsia join in the picket fence afghan pattern. Picket fence afghan is a beautiful design by Julia Farwell Clay and it's found in the MDK field guide number seven, Ease. We're working on blanket squares that have an intarsia motif and it's set up ever so cleverly where you knit always in one of the arms and purl always in the other one. So I'm going to show you how to work the intarsia join. So we've been knitting with the green yarn and we knit along until we come to the point at which we need to change colour. And then the intarsia join always works the same way. You put the old yarn that you've been working with over the new yarn that you're picking up and then you bring the new yarn to the correct side of the work ready to continue along because you're going to be purling now with this yellow yarn. Once you've worked the first stitch in the new colour it's worth giving it a bit of a tug and giving the old yarn a bit of a tug just to make sure that that join is nice and snug and then you can continue on your way. So here we're purling to the end of the row. And I'm going to show you how the join is worked on the wrong side rows of this section as well. So we're going to purl with the yellow yarn still. And now we've come to our join point again, so it works in exactly the same way. The old yarn that we've been using goes over the new yarn. And we then take the new yarn to the correct side of the work, ready to continue on our way. So we're going to be knitting with the green so it's gone to the rear of the work. Work the first stitch and then give both that stitch and the end of the old yarn a bit of a tug to make sure it's all nice and snug and continue on your way. That's the wrong side and here's how it looks on the right side. I do hope you found that little video on how to work the intarsia join in the picket fence afghan pattern by Julia Farwell Clay. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel by hitting the button at the bottom there and then you'll be sure to know when we release our next tutorial video to help you learn new techniques. Thanks ever so much for watching. Bye bye.